know how many teenage pregnancies are in the U.S. alone? Teenage pregnancy is one of the major problems in this country. Our society needs to educate teenagers on how to prevent teen pregnancy. Today, I would like to tell you about teenage statistics and inform you of the different organizations that are trying to help reduce the rate of teen pregnancy. Here's some statistics. In 2013, over 273,000 babies were born to women from aged from 15 to 19. 89% of these teenagers were unmarried. Nearly 1,700 teens aged from 15 through 17 give birth just every week. About 77% of teenage pregnancies are unplanned. 15% of these pregnancies end in mis miscarriage. 30% of these teenage pregnancies end in abortion. Here's some ethnicity statistics. 41.7 per 1,000 Hispanic girls gave birth in 2013. 39 per 1,000 African American girls gave birth in 2013. And 18.6 per 1,000 Caucasian girls gave birth in 2013. Here are some statistics worldwide. 16 million girls aged from 15 through 19 give birth each year. Complications of pregnancy is the second cause of death from girls aged from 15 through 19 every year. Three million 15 through 19 year old girls have unsafe abortions every year. Here's some of the cost of teen pregnancy. 9.4 billion tax dollars were spent on teen pregnancy and childbirth just in 2010. Only 50% of teen mothers aged from 15 through 19 earn a high school diploma. By age 30, only 1.5% of women who have pregnancies as a teenager have a college degree. 80% of unmarried mothers end up on welfare. 50% of the teenage mothers go on welfare just in the first year alone. The daughters of teenage mothers are 22% more likely than their peers to have a, a teen pregnancy themselves. And the sons of teenage mothers have, are 13% greater, have a greater chance ending up in prison than their peers. There are also organizations that help to reduce the rates of teen pregnancy. The first organization is teen is the Teen Outreach. This program is for both males and females. It is located right here in Arizona. They, have ed they provide education on pregnancy, labor, delivery, parenting, and also sexual health. There are also, there are also blogs on this website from other teen mothers. The second organization is called the Candies, Candies Foundation. This is a nonprofit organization. They educate small community organizations that are trying to help teenage pregnancy. They also have an app called the Crybaby app that lets the teens show what it's like to be a teen mother. There are also diaries from other teen mothers that they can read. Research also shows that when teenage girls are exposed to this website or this foundation, they are likely to view teen pregnancy as negative and stressful. 16 and Pregnant and Teen Mom. 16 and Pregnant was aired in the summer of 2009, which is on MTV. It follows the stories of pregnant teenage girls in high school dealing with the hardships of teen pregnancy. Teen Mom is followed by the show 16 and Pregnant. It shows the lives and the hardships of being teen mothers. A study was conducted by the National Bureau of Economic Research. They suggest that there is a correlation between the premiere of the show in 2009. There was a 5.7 decrease in teen births just after 18 months that the show was premiered. There are different ways to avoid teen pregnancy. The first way is abstinence. Then there are different forms of birth control. First form is the birth control implement. 
implant. The second form is the birth control patch. There's also a birth control shot. And the last, there's a birth control vaginal ring. Teenage pregnancy is still a major problem in the United States. However, teen pregnancy rates are falling. Teens are more aware of the different contraceptions and how to prevent pregnancy. There are many organizations that are out there to help with teen pregnancy. Just because the teen pregnancy rates are dropping does not mean that we can just sit here and do nothing. We still need to educate our teens and our children about the consequences of teen pregnancy. Thank you. You're welcome. Why did you take our picture?